Yes, of course. Hmm? Hey guys, it's Alyssa and today's video I'm doing like kind of like a pack with me video because I'm going to Florida So I'm just gonna do like a prep and pack. So what I'm doing to prep prepare for Florida and then a packing video So I'm actually about to leave for my nail appointment because like my nails are just you know plain but I'm about to leave and it's at 11 so I'm about to leave right now like in literally seven minutes um I'm just gonna take my trash out from my room right now um before I leave also there is a bump in my hair but I don't really care because like it's literally you, it doesn't look bad unless you go like this I don't know but yeah and then I, I'm gonna try to I'm not really gonna film my nail appointment but I'm gonna try to film because I have to go to Target after that I actually have to run a couple errands to be honest I have to like do a couple things but I have to get some last minute things from either Walmart or Target and then I'll be back here to do the packing because we actually leave tomorrow and I work tonight at 5, like 5 to 11. So I kind of have to do most of things like right now. And then when I get back from work, I can do some of the last minute things and then I have to be up at 8 tomorrow to leave for the airport at 9. So I have like some time, an hour to do whatever needs to be done so if you can't tell <laughs> i'm here at target so i did get my nails done this is what i did i just did like this blue and they're like shorter than i usually get them which is what i wanted so i'm really happy with the length this time but i'm about to go on target and pick up a prescription and then i'm probably gonna go to walmart for my last minute like essential things also my hair is really bugging me so i'm probably gonna redo it it's like ugh, I just got done in Walmart and I didn't buy very much or no I didn't vlog very much but I bought some things that I will show you when I get home but right now I'm gonna go to Starbucks and get maybe a drink probably not maybe I don't know and then I'm probably gonna get like some food because I'm really hungry so and I don't want to have to go home and make food because I need to pack and stuff so I'm back from shopping um, I got, I went to Starbucks and I got a grilled chicken and hummus protein box thing that I'm actually going to eat right now for my lunch. It is two o'clock. Yeah, it's like two o'clock. So I actually have to work at five. So I have two hours to pack and then I'll just have to do the rest of it. If I don't get everything done, I'll do the rest of it when I get back. Um, I also got a, I don't even know what it's called. It's like the brown sugar... Thing. it's so good i've gotten this before it's really good um anyways yeah that's all i have for you guys right now i'm gonna do like a haul of the stuff that i got later after i eat because i it's like a cold thing and i want to eat it now so all right so i'm gonna show you guys what i got at target and walmart um target i really didn't get anything except i just picked up a prescription so it's just like my acne stuff but i have to do a prescription for it so and then at Walmart is where I actually got things. Um, so I can get this untangled. Oh my gosh. So, the first thing that I got were two sets of 10 hangers for my closet because I don't have like any right now. So, I needed some more. I got this clear bag. I don't really know what I'm going to put in it yet. Something. Um, but it has like. I don't know. I just like that it was clear, to be honest. Then I can just put stuff in there. Um, I also got a toothbrush. Okay, if this opens. Toothbrush container. Um, then I also got this e.l.f. What is this even called? Clear Brow and Lash Mascara. Then I got some sunscreens. So my mom is bringing like 50 SPF, 70 SPF. But I wanted to get some 30 SPF ones. So I got Hawaiian Tropic. Tr oh my. Hawaiian Tropic. It's a 30 SPF one. And then I also decided to get this one. This is Australian gold. It's an instant bronzer, but it has SPF 30 in it. Um, just because I've never used a tanning lotion, tanning oil, anything like that. So I did want to try it. I don't know. We'll see how it works for me. I'm actually going to probably like pack everything and then kind of go through it tonight later for you guys just because i think right now i just need to pack it and then i can show you guys kind of what i packed how i packed stuff like that okay so i'm not gonna show myself right now because i'm actually like all ready for work and i just don't want to show myself but i'm gonna kind of show you what i've packed so far so this is actually my carry-on um that i'm 
burning on the plane well it's like the personal item if you know what i mean um and then i just have some of my toiletries here that are gonna go in this suitcase when i pack it i haven't packed any of my clothes yet so it's like literally completely empty except for a couple things that i'm bringing for my mom but i will go through like the suitcase later when i pack the clothes but right now i'm just gonna go through the toiletry stuff the care or the personal item bag i also have a couple things up here so i have this like bag of um checked stuff that i need my mom's bringing a check bag i'm bringing a carry-on bag so this is like um she's gonna keep this stuff for me um i will go through that in a second and i just have some stuff like laid out here for to, that i still need to use like this stuff tomorrow this tomorrow but i still just have it laid out here this stuff in that's gonna go in my mom's checked bag i just have a mo my moisturizer here um i have my perfume that i'm bringing i have a bag of salt this is not what you think it is it's salt um and it's actually because i got my cartilage pierced like a month like a couple months ago and so part of like the healing process you have to like do like a salt water solution thing so i am bringing like a teeny little bag of salt just so i can do that when i'm in florida because i don't want to like have it get infected while i'm over there um and then i have my acne stuff and then i have sunscreen that i'm bringing for myself and then i have this tanning oil and it didn't come with a cap like none of the bottles had a cap so i don't think that's like part of it so i put this little like saran wrap over it, even though it's not very like i don't know but i did put like saran wrap over it so that it would not leak in case it did um, but it's just like this tanning oil stuff that I've never used before, but I'm going to try it out. So I just have to add like a couple more things to this, like tomorrow morning, I think, that I'm using like tonight. So that's going to be there. And I am double bagging everything. So this is like the one bag and then I have another bag to go like over this. And then I actually have to go to work right now. So the rest of the stuff I will go into later tonight. So like literally in a couple seconds when you see this. But for me, it's like seven hours. Okay, guys. So I got off work hours ago, but it is now... One in the morning. I am waking up at 7.30. Which means... And, um... Okay. I have still have to pack all of my clothing. I've done all my toiletries. Basically my carry-on, pretty much. Or my personal item. I just need to pack all of my clothing. And I'm gonna do it tonight because I don't want to do it tomorrow morning. Um... Here's the thing, I actually made like a huge packing list in my phone of like everything that I'm bringing like literally down to the kind of bra that I'm bringing for different shirts and stuff. So I'm a little like, you know, in that area. So I um, did that whole list and so I basically know exactly what I'm bringing. I just have to pull it out of my closet and pack it the way I want it to because I'm rolling my stuff. I'll show you guys when I actually pack it, but yeah, but right now I'm going to show you guys my toiletries, what I'm bringing, that kind of stuff, and then I'm going to pack everything and then show you guys how, well, I'm going to show you guys what I'm bringing and then I'll pack it and then show you guys how I packed it. So I know the lighting's really bad right now, but this is what we're working with. It's literally 1am, so I don't really have a lot to work with, but this is my toiletry bag that i'm using for this trip um it roll it, like wraps up so it'll go like this and then i can also like hang it up wherever i want to hang it up that's why i bought it because i wanted the hanging thing so basically up here you can kind of see obviously but i have a lot of hoop earrings these are all my hoop earrings and i have rings in here as well that i'm bringing um in this big pocket here if i can open it <laughs> there we go um there's a lot of really random stuff i am not going to pull everything out because it's just in there and i don't want to get it tangled up more than it already is but i have earring studs in here i have one okay i literally am bringing every single necklace that i own i'm not even kidding so i have like some really fun necklaces there that you see and then i also have you can't see them but i have some other necklaces over on the side then right here i'm bringing eardrops a sun bum chapstick um, I have tweezers and nail clippers, I have my contact case, and then I have extra contacts in case the ones that I'm wearing get ripped or something, or I lose them, whatever, because literally if I lose my contacts, the trip, the rest of the trip will not be a good trip, so that's why I have these, um, and then I also have cotton balls and cotton swabs, just in case I need them, I probably won't, but you never know, um, and then this main section, 
I have a little claw clip. I don't know, just in case I want to do my hair with that. Then I have makeup wipes here. Look at this giant cup, by the way. Oh my god. You might be wondering why I'm bringing a cup and a measuring spoon thing, but it's because I got my cartilage pierced not too long ago, and I'm trying. I'm still trying to do like the healing and aftercare, and it requires like salt and water, whatever, in a cup. So I'm just gonna bring that just so I can have it and I can keep up with that. Then I have two toothbrushes here. So this one is the one that I'm gonna use on my teeth. This one right here is to clean my retainer case. Um, then I have a razor, and I'm pretty sure that's all I have. Oh, I also have a nail file. I do have acrylics in case they get bad or something. I don't know. But yeah, that's what I have in my toiletry bag here. I still have to add some more things that I still need for tomorrow morning. But after that, I'll roll it up and put it somewhere. This is my makeup and hair accessories bag. So I'm not going to take it out. But on this side, I have all of my hair accessories. So I have hair ties, scrunchies. I have a little, I don't even know what they're called. Scrunchy hair bands, whatever. Um, and then on this side, I have all my makeup. So I have a makeup palette in case I want to do eyeshadow. Probably won't, but you never know. I have a bunch of makeup brushes in here. I have mascara that I haven't used yet, eyelash curler, brushes, highlighter, contour, a bunch of different stuff. Just in case I want to do makeup, I probably will only wear like mascara, which is what I usually wear. So, but you never know. And then I still have to put some makeup in there as well that I actually have up on my desk here for tomorrow morning that I'm gonna wear, um, but I still have to put it. There's not a ton in here because I, I didn't really know what to put in here, but I have a disposable mask in case, I don't know, just in case, like up in the front here. And then I have my sunglasses in this case. I'm gonna put my actual glasses in here as well. Um, in here, I just have a chapstick. I have a pen, pencil, just in case, I don't know. And then in here, I have my AirPods, portable charger. I have like these ones just in case my AirPods die. I have gum for the plane. I also have earplugs in here. Um, and then I wanna say in this zipper thing, I put my rings. I'm not gonna wear them until I'm on the plane or until I'm there, but they're like my rings that I wanna take good care of. So that's why they're in that po pocket. Um, and here I have a empty water bottle that I'm gonna use. Whoa. I have a charger. I'm gonna put my other one in here as well, but this is just a cord for like a car charger for our rental car. Um, and then I also have my wallet in here as well, but I actually need that for tomorrow morning because I'm have to go get cash from the ATM. And then in this back pocket, I can even get in there. My God. I actually have all my masks in here. And then I have fruit snacks in case I want to eat something. And then also have this in case I want to eat something. Highly doubt I will, but you never know. I keep saying that. Why do I keep saying that? I'm like, uh... Okay, so this is all I have packed right now. Um, now it is time to tackle my suitcase. So this is what I have to pack into that suitcase. So, this is actually my mom's stuff that I'm packing for her because she has a checked luggage or she's a checked bag and um if that accidentally gets lost or something, she just wants that she needs that stuff. So that's why I'm bringing this. I am not checking this one. This is a carry-on. It's going to go above me on the airplane. So, that is why I'm bringing that for her. Um yeah, so I actually did like a test um to see what would fit in my bag and all of this fit i think i added like a couple extra things but all of it fit in there and there's still so much room and i also in case i don't have enough room i literally have this whole backpack like literally like i can put whatever i want in here so i'm literally i'm just gonna see i'm pretty sure this is all gonna fit i might bring workout shoes i don't know but i'm bringing those for sure um for shoes but I'm gonna see if this all fits in there, I'm pretty sure it will, but just in case, um, then I'll see if I, because I might want to bring some other sweatpants to sleep in, and maybe another sweatshirt, something like that, but I don't, I don't know, I'm just gonna see what fits, so I'm gonna do that right now, and I will see you guys in a minute. I just forgot to show you guys, like, what I'm bringing, like, that's, like, the whole point, okay. So, I'm bringing a ton of swimsuits, way more than I actually need, and yes, I still need to t cut off the tags on most of these. So I'm bringing four swimsuit sets and then I'm bringing like bottoms and then two tops to go with those bottoms. 
so i'm literally basically bringing five swimsuits and i'm only gonna be there like six days well, i guess that actually kind of makes sense like a swimsuit for each day but i can definitely just rewear them like it's not like i couldn't bring two and rewear them but whatever um so i'm not gonna go into that yet i do have stuff in there but i'm gonna show you guys that when i show you it fully packed over here um i have shoes that i might bring if there's room i don't know if there's gonna be room but these are shoes that i'm definitely bringing so these are gonna go in first um here i just have some miscellaneous stuff um i have my lululemon leggings i have this like sweatshirt thing and then i have a dress that i'm gonna be wearing maybe <laughs> and then right here i have pajamas so um i have these two t-shirts and then two pairs of shorts for pajamas and that's why i might bring sweatpants just in case it's cold in the hotel room i might want those um and then up here um i am bringing way too many shirts by the way i am literally bringing 13 shirts like that seems a little excessive to me but I don't really care so i'm bringing like three t-shirt type shirts and some of these might be cover up for swimsuits that's why i'm bringing so many shirts um i have these two tighter like crop tops that i might wear i have some tank tops that i can wear and then i have four tube tops so yeah four tank tops two crop tops three of these t-shirts maybe work out in them you know um and then i have four crop or two tops and then right here, I have this, like, white button-up that I can put over something or use it as a swim cover-up. I don't know yet. And then I have this shirt just to wear if it gets cold. It's long-sleeved. Or I might wear it on the plane on the way back. And then right here, I actually just have, like, five pairs of shorts. So I have two pairs of jean shorts. I have a pair of athletic shorts. A um, pair of these Shein gray shorts. I don't even know, but they're kind of cute. And I have a pair of these green shorts that I don't know how they're really going to fit or work with outfits, but I don't really care. It's whatever. So yeah, that is what I have that I'm going to pack. It's currently 1.30 a.m. Um, I started doing this at 1 and I literally have not packed anything yet. And I literally have to wake up at 7.30. <laughs> like what? Um, so basically I'm probably going to go to bed at like will probably take me like an hour to pack well 30 minutes to pack this i would say but if it doesn't go well maybe an hour um probably gonna go to like 2 30 thankfully i already took a shower and everything so all i literally have to do is take out my contacts and go to bed so so just in case you're curious i did want to show you guys how i'm packing this stuff so i'm rolling it because i think it fits the best in my suitcase personally um, so I, some, I saw someone doing this on YouTube, I don't remember who, but basically she was like stacking like clothes that she wanted to roll together. Um, for example, I have my pajamas, so I have my two pairs of shorts and then my two shirts. And then what she did is she like folded them over like this and then she rolled them up super tight and that's the way that I'm doing it and I just find it works best and they fit really well so that's what I'm doing. All right, so this is what my suitcase is looking like right now. I definitely had more room the last time I did this. Um, I don't really know. Whatever. I don't really care but yeah. Um, also I did okay so I just have underwear up there right now. You guys can kind of see that it's kind of gross but whatever. Um, and I had to move my bras and my socks down into this section, and I was gonna bring tennis shoes, but then I realized I'm really not gonna wear them, and I was gonna, like, work out, but I'm like, whatever, I don't really care. I probably won't go down to that gym anyway, so that's the only reason that they were gonna be used. So, um, yeah, so I took the tennis shoes out, and then I put the bras and socks down there instead of up there, because... I'm scared that when I close it, it's going to be too, like, high for, you know, like, the overhead bins on the flights. And I've, like, looked up the sizing, and it says right now that it's fine, but I'm still scared that I'm not going to be able to get it in there. So, that's why I did take some stuff out. And then I still have these two bags, but I'm actually going to put them both in here because I do have a lot of room. I think I'm still going to bring sweatpants, though. Maybe not a sweatshirt. Because I still have to have room if I want to get something there. So that's why I'm only going to bring sweatpants, I think. And I'm just going to get a sweatshirt there if I feel like it. 
so i just wanted to show you guys my little toiletry bag before i put it away so the things that i have i have a face sunscreen i have my mini contact solution mini hand sanitizer um toothpaste i have um conditioner and shampoo i have this lotion like hand lotion and i'm pretty sure that's all i have yeah that's all i have for my little travel stuff um and yeah so i'm putting this in my carry-on bag so that's why they all have to be miniature and then like i said i'm checking that bag in my mom's suitcase okay so it is now like 2 20 something like that i have to wake up in like five hours so i'm going to bed now i am basically completely packed um the only thing is i just have to add some things like in the morning when i wake up um just some things i need to use like makeup and deodorant stuff like that you know that i'm gonna use i have to still have to add it um yeah so i feel like i didn't pack as tightly as i could have i feel like i don't know but it's whatever it all fit and the reason why i was so scared is i'm just scared that like it's not gonna fit in the compartment up there so that's why i was like rearranging everything like if i had been able to put every you know yeah i don't know if i hadn't had to rearrange things would have fit a lot differently i would have had more room but it's whatever so i'm gonna end the video here and then i don't think i'm gonna vlog florida but i'm gonna do like a travel diary thing um and if you want to follow me on social media to kind of like see photos from florida and stuff then my instagram is here on the screen i think that's the only place that i'll probably post so make sure to follow me for florida pictures because that's probably the only place that i'll really be posting i have my outfit here ready to go for tomorrow just so i don't have to like think about it it's just right there low-key maybe overpacking but like tbh i don't care like it's whatever honestly so yeah um i hope you guys enjoyed this video i know it's, i feel like it was pretty long to be honest i think this might be like a longer video of mine but you know gotta fit everything in there so i hope you guys enjoyed and i hope to see you in my next video make sure to subscribe if you're not already and yeah i will see you in my next one bye Curious butterflies. You mean bread and butterflies? Oh yes, of course. Uh, hmm?